coast now We just hit the wave like it's the coast now When we leave the city, turn your city to a ghost town Good morning, hello, good afternoon, whatever time it is, wherever you are in the world watching this video, howdy do. So I'm speaking a little bit soft, so I'll be turning up my voice in post, and that's just because Jonathan is still sleeping. It's almost 7 a.m. here in Jamaica at the time of this voiceover, and I really don't want to speak any louder to wake him in. So I'm starting out by doing my brows. I would normally do my brows. This is my air main pencil, but whatever pencil you have. You can go ahead and um, use it. You can use what color you like. Just do your brows to your preference. This is how I prefer to do my brows. So this is how I am doing my brows. And to me, my skin is looking worse again. And I'm on my you know what. As women, we go through this every single month. <laughs> So it had, that has a lot to do with my skin right now. On the right side of my face, I have completely broken out. They're like bumps and cuts and lumps in my face. So that's quite discouraging. So whatever, Mother Nature. Um, yeah, so I am just doing my brows as per usual. And in this voiceover, I'm going to attempt to go through everything that I do and the reasons why I do them. So this is my Sasha um, Cosmetics Jamaica pencil. And I said Sasha Cosmetics because I got it from Sasha cosmetics jamaica on instagram but it's the sasha brand itself um here in jamaica we do have a retailer and that is sasha cosmetics jamaica on instagram so i'm doing the ends of my brows because i cut off the ends of my brows and i've been doing this for years it's not a trend that i followed i actually saw one of my friends melissa you guys know her i've done her makeup here on my channel already um so i saw her do it because she said that she don't have an arch or something like so and I liked it and I've never looked back so it's going on like what seven or so or six years since I've done this so this is my Sasha concealer in oh my god caramel I think oh my but this Sasha concealer is so it is so full coverage i'm about about another one i have a backup i'm completely in love with this um concealer and this the consistency of the such um complexion products are absolutely phenomenal so i do recommend that you do check them out on instagram so as you can see i'm just um <coughs> excuse me etching out my brows or or um we call it uh cleaning up my brows as they say but look how much sharper that looks this technique has been done for years people have modified it I, in my classes especially my classes coming up in florida this year in may um they i teach a technique called isolation and that's the technique that i learned from buntrisha bastian so and it's an amazing technique for certain eyebrows and it's it just works it works so <clears throat> i want to take this time to say what i teach in my classes this is not i don't do on my youtube channel what i teach in my classes and that's mainly for value purposes so you can't say oh yeah mr lyric do that because you do that in every day that you teach our class can't be done can't be said because i don't teach the same as how i do my makeup on youtube how I do my makeup on youtube is just for youtube but what i teach is completely different yes some techniques are the same but i teach it differently jonathan waking up I hear making noise so I'm still using my Sasha cosmetics concealer and I am going on top um, I believe I said this before but I put the black on the the ends to because that's where my brows naturally cut off and I want to maintain that depth also I love how the ombre brows look they're quite theatrical they're a statement and I love doing the ombre brows so that is what I do for my <coughs> for my eyebrows um, I am wearing um lash clusters not the extensions that you put on individually i'm wearing the clusters and i am um these are installed myself and i have videos here on youtube of how i do my lash extensions or my lash clusters so you can probably well, i'll see if i can find them and link them in the description bar for you guys so this is real time of me doing my brows this is how it typically take me to do my brows when i want to get them right and perfect in a perfect world i would have done them under a minute but I like my brows a certain way and I don't mind spending time to do it now this entire look took me probably 30 minutes so probably half an hour a little less than 30 minutes to do <sighs> okay so remember when I used to put like a lighter color concealer right up my brow bone 
I no longer do that because I realize it <coughs> excuse me it um it makes that area of my brows stand out as in the colors that are placed on it it's not blended out especially in the photos so I no longer do that um I want to say this again how I do my makeup and my clients makeup as well as a makeup artist is also different and that simply because of face facial shape skin type the brows they have so on and so forth um yeah so this brush I'm using is from Sedona Lace and I can't remember the name of the brush but oh my god I am in love by the way you guys I'm getting the samples of my new brush set um, if um, if you guys follow me on snapchat you would have seen it and please do follow me on snapchat on um, Instagram on Facebook as well because I'm becoming more and more interactive when I say interactive I mean I'm posting a lot let me not say interactive because interactive means that I'm talking to you guys on a daily which I don't because the truth is it's just me alone and I don't really have the time to like just sit on social media every single day day in day out because they have other obligations i do have jobs i have to go out to and my wife's so after the wife stuff mother mother stuff i have to go on the road we're now shipping the poor me fitness belts oh my god you guys i am beyond excited poor me fitness belts are finally in but as soon as they come in they're going to be sold out because of um the, the amount that we ordered so the next order that i'm looking to do i want to order to do a big big one so that i can have them in stock for a good while so that's the aim so again i'm still working on my brows <laughs> we are at the six minute mark and i am still working on my brows this is literally how long it takes me to do my brows i like when my brows are nice and smooth and damn near perfect all right so um i've been getting not i've been getting but there's a couple of people who do i'm literally on my phone guys i get really really limited when i do my makeup i really love um what do you call it now um, watching something or or yeah watching i love watching youtube or listening to my audio bible whenever i do my makeup i enjoy it so now i'm going in with my fenty primer and I'm just putting it on now these this amount I'm just putting it on the four parts of my face. Now this amount that I've put on is too much. You see the amount I put on my two side of my cheeks, that kind of my entire face. I put on way too much. I haven't worn this prime primer in a while, so I kinda what you call it? Um misjudged the amount that I needed. I don't need this much. By the way, my bonnet is from Isaken Enofe on instagram and it's again nfa dot com you can purchase there look at how white my face is i'm prior to this um i'm, I'm not prior underneath my primer which is what i'm wearing now i'm actually wearing coconut oil and i put the primer on my lids as well because it's a primer it's a face primer so it can go on the eyelids i do not have a specific eye primer i have eyeshadow bases but not eye primers so i'm just blending out this area so that when i put my foundation on everything blends a little bit more um smooth a little bit a little bit more seamlessly <sighs> there's a video that i recorded and filmed um last week please go ahead and watch it in the description bar below it i've never done a video like that before and at the end of this video I will go ahead and link it in the end cards so I would really appreciate it if you guys watch it and just understand where I'm coming from so this is my Fenty foundation in the color I'm in is 420 and I love this foundation black opal and the Sasha cosmetics these are foundations I completely completely stand by oh my god you guys as in oh, they're absolutely oh and it's your face cosmetics and shades by gal those four foundation companies your know, those four companies their the foundations are bomb i completely hands down recommend anyone you get it would be a good purchase and an amazing investment now um remember in one of my videos i can't i don't know if you guys notice if you guys watch my videos like that but 
my face was looking hella darker than my skin now apart from doing the banish because i'm still doing banish but i haven't done the needling i just did the complexion stuff like the masks and um yeah i noticed that my face has gotten darker but along with banish i'm also using a new soap i'm using a cinnamon soap and the cinnamon soap is good for scarring it says and acne so i'm using the cinnamon soap but i have a turmeric um, a mask that I'll be testing out for you guys for the month of January, March, April, May, May. Um, by the time this goes up, it's May. So happy May, you guys. Happy May. And you know what? I'm going to put this video up on May 1st. Happy May 1st. The brush I'm using is Mark Jacobs brush. It's a phase 2 brush. This brush retails for $70. It is more than the brush set I, complete. I currently have at Fontana Pharmacy. Oh my god. Guys, my brushes are still at Fontana Pharmacy. And it would mean a lot if you guys if you guys would just go over there and support as much as you can if you shop on fontanapharmacy.com and you spend more than fifty dollars you automatically automatically get free shipping and of course the brushes are fifty dollars so you get automatic free shipping so to do my highlight i'll be using cool tan and of course it's from la pro conceal <sighs> no fontana pharmacy on instagram fontanapharmacy.com please you can go out and check them out my brushes are on their website the lashes are on their website as well um, <coughs> excuse me so I can check that out um, what else right so oh my gosh I don't know what else to say you guys I'm blending out with my beach cosmetics brush I love this brush so much um, I really have nothing else to say everything is just as you see it it's just how I'm doing it in real time um, oh I want to address something I want to address um, the music that I use the reason why I'm consistently using DAJ is because my, I do not get a copyright strike whenever I use his music even when I use my own music I get a copyright strike and the strike means that you can't make money from that video um, YouTube for me is a career I do make money from from um, um from from youtube but as a true <laughs> this way sound weird but as someone who wants to create wealth i don't put all my eggs in one basket so uh, my income don't don't only come from youtube but wherever my income comes from i always give a hundred percent i give a hundred percent on youtube hundred percent in my brands like pull me fitness pull me by lyric hundred percent in whoever i'm the brand ambassador for a hundred percent i give a hundred percent in everything that I do um, whenever you're creating wealth it is not wise to just invest in one thing if you invest in one thing then find and have that money turnover and you then you reinvest or you find other methods but the aim is to make your money work for you while you are sleeping um, in my Florida classes coming up this is what I'll be talking about as well I want to talk about how my girls can make wealth from the talent because the Bible says that your gift make room for you and bring it before kings and queens and it is not lying it is the truth you will literally be met by royalty you'll be contacted by royalty by people who you look up to because remember you know, for us those people are royalty as well people who we look up to um on my lyric uncut channel um that's my vlog channel i am vlogging now probably two or three times a week and that's something as well that i can i've been making um, money from as which is why i am also um i've shifted my focus with my vlog channel and i'm looking at it from one a business standpoint and two as a window to just open up to you guys and to just relate to you uh i do that somewhat here on my lyric watch us on uh, um, youtube channel that you're watching now <laughs> but for my vlog channel i'm just i love my don't get me wrong i love both my channels but my vlog channel is a very special place in my heart because it's helping me excuse me it's helping me to excuse me track my fitness excuse me track my fitness um i recently started doing what i eat in a week videos over there as well and that also is helping me to stay on track and to just you know stay motivated a, a big thing in the world today is how do you stay motivated how do you stay motivated oh this is my um sasha cosmetics buttercup press powder and again all my sasha products are from sasha cosmetics jamaica on instagram right so the biggest thing in this world is finding motivation oh i'm just not motivated oh i'm just not motivated that's the biggest thing in this world and the truth is i am not motivated every single day um but what keeps me going is that i really have goals i am discouraged 
almost every single morning before I have to leave out of my house to go to the gym. And I say probably I work out because of my new training program. I work out six times a day. And I promise I'm, I'm discouraged probably f not times, six days a week. My rest days on a Sunday. And I promise you I'm discouraged at least four times out of the week to go to the gym. But once I get there, once I get my music going, oh my God, it just works for me. So now I'm going in with... I think this is Mocha and this is their Pro Powder. Another Pro Powder. This is from Sasha Cosmetics as well. I use it to do my low light, but obviously I can use it. It's an all over face powder, but I just use it for my low lights. And guys, this thing is hella full coverage. This powder it is absolutely amazing. Everything that I've gotten from Sasha Cosmetics Jamaica, it it's just been blowing my mind so much so that I actually went back and I purchased for my kit. If you want me to do an updated what's in my makeup artist kit um, um, video, I can definitely do that for you. So just go ahead and let me know below. And if you don't mind, to thumbs up the person who requested it so I can know that you guys want to see it. Um, so now I'm just pinching my brush and I'm doing this side of my nose, which is... I don't know maybe because I've been doing it for so much years I know how to manipulate different tools I know how to make products work for me I really do and maybe the everyday person will think that it is too much or I can never accomplish that never say so you can't accomplish anything it is absolutely a slap even if you don't believe in God whoever you think brought you here it's a slap in their face because the human mind, human mind, sorry, it is more capable of what you think it is capable of. So this is my Sasha um, setting powder and this is in the color Perfect Spice. <sighs> Never doubt yourself. I've been doubting myself for a very long time and I didn't think I would be in this, in this, 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 this place where companies outside of makeup companies are contacting me for promotion they're contacting me to work with me they see the value in what i have to offer and that's what the bible says your gift will make room for you you have to trust the process yes you're going to be weary yes you're going to get annoyed and yes you're going to be tired but you have to trust the process you completely have to trust the process it is always a process the only way you fail is if you give up that's a buttercup again more than a conqueror so i'm i think i'm rehearsing the song because we're singing on sunday breakthrough you guys have seen it on my instagram breakthrough so that is on sunday so that's what i am rehearsing as i'm doing this video for you guys i don't mind doing um full length videos but it, i have to use music because if not then you guys are stuck listening to my voice for over half an hour and most times i have to be speaking softly because i'm doing it early in the morning when i just come back from the gym <sighs> speaking about the gym <laughs> i've started a new workout program and it's um from a jazzy fit on instagram and if you do go over there and you know tell her hey you know let her know i sent you um her name is a jazzy fit and i've been doing her workout program i'm in week two of her workout program and i'm telling you week one i was sore for days do you hear me Days and I'm not new to work out and your girl was sore um, yeah so that's one so I've been doing that and also her workout program is formulated for progressive overload meaning as you go you lift heavier and stronger and that's what I've been doing and I've been seeing and I've changed my diet I'm going to be making a full video on my lyric uncut channel about that as well and that's why I love my lyric uncut channel I can share i can do these type of things guys i'm really sorry i'm literally on my this is what happens i'm on my phone so this makeup took me probably 20 minutes 25 minutes but this is a raw uncut get ready with me a raw uncut get ready with me video um so the reason why the powder is still on my face is because i kind of want it to quote unquote bake or to just sit there a bit while I do everything else so by the time I blend it into my skin it is nice and matte you now what most youtubers they like brush it away but I don't do that I push I push even the excess because when I put it on my skin to sit it is being absorbed so it's already settling it is setting rather it is setting so in, rather than just dust it away I actually push it into my skin to have it further set so there's like no crease no lines no nothing whatsoever you can you can brush it in and push it in with a 
sponge but it's not as porous i believe so i believe like a brush is way better to just push it in with and yes i'm still on my phone this is what this is what happens you guys i'm, I'm sorry this is the raw uncut virgin of me doing my makeup this is what happens you guys i'm gonna look at some now watch my show oh my god i used to be addicted to elementary and sherlock and now i've watched everything like all the seasons i'm just sitting here bored If you guys have any good Netflix recommendations, please list them in the description. I mean, just let me know in the comment section. This is my powder blush. It's called Amber Glow and it's from Sasha Cosmetics. And this brush is from BH Cosmetics. Um, yeah, in Jamaica, I don't get... Because some of you guys recommend some shows, but when I search for them, I don't have them. So maybe Netflix goes by location and location in terms of pop popularity within a certain genre or a certain movie because i don't get i don't see some of the stuff that you guys recommend because when i ask for recommendations on my vlog channel and you guys do recommend i don't see them whenever i search for them so i can only chat that up to ge geographical location hey yes more than victor yes girl get it hey what you doing oh yeah 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 okay um, so it's my color pop palette and I started up with this thinking, you know, it would have given me the depth that I wanted Did not work. So I'm just going to do what I did on one side on the other side Because if I didn't see then it would have looked lopsided. So now I'm going with the black which is what I just should have just gone straight into um, This is my MAC 217 brush guys Believe me you need a MAC 217 in your life You need a MAC one seven brush in your life or a brush that's this sh shape you need it in your life it is absolutely amazing i wish i had more i really wish i had more i love it so much um it just fits right into my crease and i have hooded eyes you know and it fits right into my crease i absolutely love it all right so this is going to be the look primarily using my sasha blush as well as um uh, uh my black eyeshadow so i'm just going to blend it and that's basically it so that's what i do for the eyes um and for my wait what that name lash line waterline air the my lower lash line i went in with my sasha cosmetics black eyeliner pencil and then again with the blush with the same blush that i'm using now the amber glow blush so i'm going in with my beauty bakery um face and eyes and face face and eyes palette and i'm putting that on my brow bone i almost forgot that i used this on my brow bone so it has a nice little hint of you know iridescence but not too much i love that see that it's not too much just gives a little it's just it just gives a little pizam and because again i do have hooded eyes so by doing this step my brow bone comes out a little bit more at you which is always over aim all right so now i'm going to move on i'm sorry i'm going back in my with my color pop palette i'm just going to intensify that black and that's the that's the eye look you guys yeah so this is basically what i am doing um that's why i play music in my videos because like for me it's just because i did so often too it has become routine but i can understand if you guys prefer this type of videos where there are no steps skipped and they're seeing everything in real time so earlier on i said that i used my sasha pencil i was wrong i actually used my la pro primer yes it's an eye primer but i'm completely in love with the black the black is perfect for the lips you guys if you've seen me use tan lips before and it's also perfect for the eyes as like an eyeliner and then you smoke it out oh the smoke out ability on this bad boy is so sexy um no it does smudge which is why i always set mine and i also like using an eyeshadow underneath it as well just to make sure it doesn't run as much but it does smudge and because it's on a very um damp area as in my um we call that when my inner eye name again lash 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 line oh my gosh 
you know what I mean? The fleshy part of my eyes because it's in there as well. It's really damp. So yeah. So this again is my Amber Glow Blush from Sasha Cosmetics. As you guys can see, I am head over heels for this blush. It is so versatile. And because it is orange, it is... I love orange. <sighs> orange eyeshadows, orange blushes, a deeper orange, a lighter orange. I love how orange it looks on me. I think it looks absolutely gorgeous. Now I switched out brushes. I'm using like a, a rounder, um, tapered a rounder brush before he's using like a smudge brush and i'm using like a rounded brush so i'm going back in with the amber glow and i'm just blending out and bringing the color a little bit further up on my brow bone <sighs> look at how gorgeous that looks and i'm not even wearing like strong heavy lashes i love it now what i did here was i kind of went down a little bit on my nose bridge you see that and i love how it looks yes i am having fun rehearsing so I am pushing it I'm not brushing it away see I'm, I'm pushing it into my skin see that I'm pushing it into my skin and it sits beautifully you see that you can still see the low light as well as my um, my face we call it my, my low light as well as my all over face powder as well I love me a flat top brush so in my next set obviously in most in all my sets I've had a flat top brush and I'm so proud about the new set that's coming and as usual I'm going to do a discount um, because they've been out for so long as well and everything I bought this set is completely different I've never done a brush handle color like this I've never done a brush handle like this and it is more expensive to have it made this is my um beauty bakery palette by the way and i realized that this looks a little bit ashy on me but when i um, put on my sasha my way call it my finishing spray or my setting spray it just it works on my skin so this glow of course you can build it up but i didn't want to i want it to stay a little bit muted I love how it looks um yes yeah, so i am so excited about this brush sets i can't wait to get the samples in and use them in tutorials for you guys but let me know if you would want me to do a pre we call it uh, um we call it a pre oh lord i'm having brain fart what's this called a pre-order let me know if you guys want to do a pre-order the brushes will be selling for 75 dollars but if we're going to do a pre-order i will definitely have them for 20 dollars off for you guys as well as free shipping the thing is that with free shipping your products don't come in until the two weeks so if i do a pre-order then the products won't be ready until the month and then after the month they'll be shipped so your products won't get your brushes won't get to you until six week time six week time so let me know what you guys think about that you can go ahead and vote right now so the brushes will be reselling for $75 as I said but I'm going to take off $20 and sell it for $55 and it also include free shipping so let me know if that's something that you guys will be interested in <coughs> excuse me <coughs> something you've been interested in and it is a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 piece brush set the lippy that I use is Saint Germain and my liner pencil was LA girl in espresso and this is the look absolutely gorgeous I love it um I did this look in less than 20 minutes to be quite honest and I was filming because I went on my phone if I was just galvanized and focus on this look alone I would be done I'll be done in 20 minutes so you guys thank you so much for watching thank you for your love and your support please don't forget to vote on the brushes let me know what you think about that and um yeah, my class is in Tamarack, Florida. Don't forget to go on my website and look about that as well. So I'll talk to you guys in the next video. When we leave the city, turn your city to a ghost town. Turn the music up, cause it's going down. And we ain't slowing down.